If I want to filter a deal, it's quite simple to do. I want to make sure that I'm starting off from the sales deals page here and make sure that I'm in the correct sales pipeline here. I then have the option of opening up this drop down here and filtering specifically for my deals, my one deals this month, or new deals this month. Uh, I also can come down here and I have a couple of property options that will allow me to filter. If I want to filter by amount, if I want to filter by when the date was created, uh, or if I have specifics uh, on which deal owner that I want to filter by. Uh, finally, I can open up this more filters and have access to all of the different deal properties. So if I want to filter by deals that have a close date in this case, we'll select close date is known, apply the filter. I'm going to go ahead and close out of this and you can see that of the two deals that we had in place here we've now filtered it down to one if i want to save this view for further usage later on down the line all i have to do is come up to the right side here select save view and uh, save as new once i do that i can go ahead and select whether i want to share it with everyone or just myself and then i want to go ahead and give this a name And now you'll see up top, my view has changed to test here. This will be accessible at any point in time later on down the line if I want to come back into this. Uh, but that's how you go ahead, filter your deals and create a view. Mm -hmm.